So I've been like seeing the all businesses procuring diesel in very uh, unsafe manner and they're transporting it in drums which is not at all safe. So I always used to have a question how to solve this. My startup is mainly about getting uh, fuel to the doorstep. Uh, we uh, right now are uh, delivering diesel. Uh, in future we are like looking for uh, delivering more types of uh, fuels that are required for B2B. My dad and my uncle actually owns a lot of fuel stations uh, in Andhra and Telangana region. So I've been like seeing the all businesses procuring diesel in very uh, unsafe manner. So I always used to have a question how to solve this. So that is when we decided we know the problem what the consumers are facing. They have a lot of accountability issues, theft issues, contamination issues. So what we do we try to solve every single thing and we reconstructed the complete supply chain right from the oil terminals. We deliver them pure fuel and there is accountability to it. So uh, as you can see that's our fuel delivery browser. It's equipped with all the safety measures that are required. It is basically stamped by a uh, petroleum and safety organization which ensures the safety fittings are uh, in place or not. Every liter that is dispensed from my truck, I track it. Whenever I load any liter that goes in or goes out, I have a hold on it. And also, we built a black box. It monitors the driver's pattern, his braking pattern because there is a fuel that is carried uh, in the back. So, he shouldn't exceed a certain speed limit in the city. And also, how much fuel is in the tank is something what we need to know every moment. So there are uh, fuel level sensors in the truck which monitor every day. We know how much fuel is there in the truck and also the driving pattern of the driver. And also this is a very uh, interesting thing what we incorporated. If there is a customer who ordered fuel, the truck can't dispense fuel anywhere else. We geofence his coordinates. When the vehicle reaches that location, Within that radius only, the truck can uh, operate fuel dispensing or else there can't, there can't be any fuel dispensing that can happen. So I, this is my company. I jumped directly into an entrepreneurship journey. So this 100 days program, what here I was part of, taught me a lot of things. Not only making me fundraising ready, uh, I'm more clear on where I want to head. Tia actually shaped my vision a lot. This is a huge industry. I'm in... I was very unclear where we are heading. There is a lot of openings, there is a lot of grey area. They have a lot of workshops which can give you a more clarity on what you do. Basically, my business grew by 20 to 30 percent, almost, just with the help of TIA. So, uh, five years from now, there's a lot coming over. The regulations are actually changing every day. So, bracing ourselves for this fast-changing things. And also, uh, we want to evolve as an ecosystem where we are going today to this diesel consumer for his fuel. But this diesel consumer needs multiple other things. It could be insurance, it could be lubricants, it could be tires, anything. So we want to get that to the doorstep where we'll enable this Anytime Diesel ATD as a platform for all the point of sale applications. Okay.